What's up everybody and today we are reacting to Escape from Tarkov Raid Episode 5. It's been a while since we reacted to this stuff. I had to do a little bit of a recap to remember what happened in the previous ones. Uh, but if, if there was anything that I could remember from previous episodes, it's the quality. The quality of these are amazing. The shots, the action shots were phenomenal. The tactics were brilliant. Um, so I'm excited to see what they've done in the finale and to see where it goes, where they do this little short story. Um, but five episodes, this is over an hour long altogether now. So they pretty much made like a short movie, really. Um, and I'm all about it. So uh, let's just get straight into it, shall we? Let's pop it up and let's start reacting. No idea what that says. Battle State Presents. Line all the way up. I'm sure if it's the finale, they're going to put a bunch into it. And I hope they make more. After the success of this, anyway. I'd love to see a whole TV show, to be honest with you. Really would. Alright. Is that a cheeky peek? There it is. It's definitely not yours. Show me your hands. Show me your fucking hands. Ooh, okay. Episode five. Let's go. Let's go. Слышь, в одиночку тебе все равно отсюда не выбраться. Так что ты либо ебош, либо пугаем эти деревья. I wonder if I put um. Yeah. You were a shitty opponent. That's why I'm done. Don't you know the terror group is planning to launch a controlled chaos? And Tarkov is just the beginning. This case contains classified documents about all the bio experiments. Поэтому я и должен доставить эти улики своему командованию. Do you believe them? We were supposed to give the case back to terror group. But I have a better plan. We can shoot each other right here, right now, and be done with it. Or we can try to get away from Tarkov and hand off this shit about Terror Group to independent media. That's what you should be doing. Yep. You decide. Yep. You should be going to independent media. You're right. Hell yeah! When stuff like that happens, you can never really trust anyone. So get it out in the media. Let the people see what it is, and let the people decide what's gonna what's gonna happen. I'm all about this, guys. I'm all about this. The freaking little muzzle flashes. Oh, I feel like you'd hear the rounds a lot, a lot louder though. Let's be honest. But they could have used blanks. They could have used blanks and. They're not as loud as regular rounds, but they're still pretty damn loud. And if that's what they got from that distance, then so be it. Gorka, Gorka, prием. Gorka, prием. Yeah, you, they're gonna get Gorka, found out soon if you don't hurry up. Чёрт наш кольцо не отвечает. Не думаю, что у него просто родика сдохла. Борис. Борис. А если этот вафел у нас просек и наш фокус не удался? Clean. Let's go. Boris, 
где тебя носит? Борис, твою мать, прием. Там склин. А ты случайно не знаешь, где твой шеф шляется? Вот твой хабар. Где мой нестечок? А глупый, где мой нестечок? Слышь ты, нордический. А может тебя пора уже сектантом сбагрить? Как думаешь, мы выручим за тебя хотя бы сраный тозик? Ну? How many rounds did you put in that magazine so far? Who knows? Maybe something went wrong. Like 50 rounds in it so far. Pop. Yeah, there we go. All right. So first, firstly, let's just talk about what's gone on. How quickly. It's basically got into what's happening. So they're trying to obviously get the hell out there, get that thing to independent media. And they're cleaning house still. They're not messing about. They're not just hanging around and waiting to sneak get sneaky beaky out. Even though they are going sneaky beaky, they're taking lads out. And they're doing it their own way and trying to find like oh, that guy's obviously trying to find his stuff as well, whatever that is. Это 23.09. Ко мне приходил человек, хотел приобрести билет из Таркова на Большую Землю. В обмен на вашу кирилле багаж. Окей, окей. Все, я тебе дам это. Наш Минобороны уже по-тихому блокировал эту работу. Прикинь, морскую порцию его засудки превратили в крепость. See, there were a lot of people who wanted to test it. Ну так после эвакуации гражданских и местная жушера тоже решила это сделать. So you get a ticket to get the hell out. Fuck the pass out of here. That's rough. Ooh, careful. Careful, guys. Look, Russian. No matter what happens next, I want you to savor the moment. Savor the moment. The last time we were together, when we kicked the Nazis' ass. That's interesting. Ваш пропуск не распознан. Попробуйте еще раз. Еще раз? То еще раз. Давай работай. Давай, блять. Давай. Давай, блять. Давай работай, сука! Why is it not working? Green. Go green. Сыпись. Все теперь точно пизда. Boom. Hey, pal. Look. Ваш пропуск не идентифицирован. Оставьте ваше оружие. Работай. Работай. I think the American act is a little bit cheesy, um, but it's still really good. Oh, little doggo. Look at the round, look at the guns, holy. Seems too easy. Yeah, just seems too easy. 
Look at that shot. Look at that shot. That was, oh, that was good. That was good. That was good. Tell you what, the effects they have on these are better than some movies. I've said that in previous ones, but hot damn, that shot where we're shooting through the trees, like it legit looked like they put a camera out there and just shot around it with uh, a couple of tracers in the mag. That's what it looked like. Oh, yeah, I don't know about that. This is amazing. This is genuinely amazing. How are they getting away? How are they doing this? Most freaking Hollywood films can't make it look this good. Like, this is... The visuals are like 10 out of 10 right now. Like, I've not seen a Hollywood movie look this good in a long time when it comes to military movies. These guys need to make movies and... T these, need these guys need to make a TV show. They really, really do. The sound is so good, guys. I literally can't get over how fucking cool this is. The sound is so on point. I don't know how they've done it. Yeah, the American actor is a little bit cheesy. Like, it sounds like his voice is just, it's its a little bit off. Like, it doesn't sound like it would be if he was actually saying it there in that war zone. Like, it sounds like he's saying it in a studio and talking over it. That's the only, that's literally the only gripe I've got about this. Everything else is, like, picture perfect right now, guys. <laughs> Yeah, 
So when I said that thing would tear it up, most movies have it so it hits the car and the cars cover like you see when they're shooting handguns and the car doors are covers and stuff. It just wouldn't happen. That thing would tear it tear through that concrete block to be fair, but I don't think the shooter knows they're there. Or at least he thinks they might have already died. But then guys behind the car just got lit up. I wanna watch it. <laughs> Good. That's so good. Go, 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 center. Surely they made it, surely. Surely. Holy crap. Holy crap. Holy crap. Holy crap. Who are these guys? Found it. They wanted it. Jackpot. So whoever whoever it was knew what they were going for. Oh, oh my god. Oh часов назад в Сан-Пес ООН созвал экстренное оповещание из-за очередного обострения в Норвинской области. В минувшие сутки в районе местного морского порта были слышны выстрелы и взрывы артиллерийских мин. Это первый случай применения тяжелого вооружения на блокированных территориях. сан ООН выразил на этот счет серьезную озабоченность. Но российские власти в очередной раз заверяют мировое сообщество, что ситуация находится под полным контролем. Like Однако командование миротворческих сил ООН, присутствующих в регионе, скептически относятся к подобным заявлениям. They need to make a TV show about this. Like, legit. If, if someone hasn't approached them, like Netflix, HBO, or Showtime, or something, about making this into a TV show, they're missing out. They are missing out. Holy crap. That was good. Quite a long credit. Do we get, like, a cheeky post-credit scene or anything? No. We don't. I'm blown away, guys. I am absolutely blown away. Absolutely blown away. I have not seen something like that since, like, Black Hawk Down. Like, honestly, there's some there's some really good war movies out there. Um, like, recent ones, like 19, 1917. Um, um, and then... Um, you know what I mean? There's, 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 there's a few decent war films out there, but recent years we've been lacking military films, like really lacking ones, especially modern military films. Like we're getting the stuff back in World War One, World War Two, um, but we haven't had a good modern war film in a long time. And it doesn't have to be 
based on an actual war. It could be something like this, like Tarkov. And I'd be all for it. I would be all for it. Um, I think the last... What was the last modern military film that I watched or TV show? Maybe Generation Kill? Maybe? Um, that might have been the last one I've seen. Or the last one that I can remember. Obviously, there's all these newer films like Dunkirk in 1917 that are more... more um, the new, but the, the 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 more recent, but the the World War One and World War, both World War One films, aren't there? World War One, Dunkirk, World War One, end of World War One. I can't remember. World War Two. Anyway, I digress. Um. Yeah, we need this. We I need this in my life. I genuinely need this in my life. Um, Battle State. You are brilliant. I'll leave a link down below for the original video. Please go over there, give it a like, subscribe to them, and all that good stuff because they genuinely, genuinely deserve it because that is something else, guys. It's something else. Members, you're amazing. I love you. I couldn't do this without you. Oh, and by the way, people asking me to play Tarkov, I tried playing it, and I'm absolutely dog shit at it. I'm terrible at it. I'm so bad at it. So bad at it that it's not even worth playing. Uh, maybe one day if I get better at Master Keyboard, but I'm so bad at that game. It's not even worth it guys You guys would hate me. You would hate me for it <laughs> Members you're amazing. I love you. I couldn't do this without you I honestly couldn't make videos every single day if it wasn't for all these members right here So thank you guys for supporting the channel as much as you do. I am More than thankful for it. I really am um, Links down below to all my socials including the two links to Discord. We've got the military thing link for all things military That's joining the military Getting fit for the military, join that link. We also have the second Discord, Original Human Geek, for all things geeky. That is SCP, D&D, &D, Star Wars, Halo, Metro, you name it. It's all in the geek link. Also, link down below to my podcast and my Twitch stream, where I stream Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays. Every Monday now on the stream, it's going to be dedicated to a military chat or military game or something where we react to military videos, we chat about joining the military. That's going to be every Monday, and it's going to be a ton of fun, so definitely join us for that. I'll remind you guys after after I play Metro on Monday, all right? Um, and if you can't catch the streams, they do get uploaded a few days later on the second channel, Original Human Geek, where we also put stuff up like D&D &D and uh, Try Not To Laugh and some other really good stuff. Wow. And obviously, I'll leave a link down below to the OG video. Go and share it some love because that is one of the best things I've seen on YouTube. Take it easy, everyone. Have a wonderful day. Goodbye.